23 hours into the game. It's actually gone pretty quick. And we may, we may only be out of the tutorial at this point. I, because we just got all of the styles for Majima and Kiryu in terms of fighting, unless um, there's going to be more than what's on the D-pad. Kind of doubt it, though. All right, meeting up with Oda and Tachibana Real Estate uh, from Tachibana Real Estate at Cafe Alps on Nakamichi Street. That's the current objective. We uh, we found ourselves into some side missions uh, at the end of last stream. I think we've got a couple still kicking around. So it might not be the worst warm up to do. Uh... Oh. It's also like me remembering how to play before I like, end up with against a boss that I can't. I disagree with that. Get your skull smashed in. What's remained consistent between all of the RGG games that I've played is just the, the force in which people get hit and knocked to the ground is just something to behold. <laughs> Little ramen to refill the health. <laughs> I think the biggest change for me, like, in terms of, like, uh, just overall game is that the, the loss of having a map marker. Granted, at this point, I, I, for the most part, know my way around Camarocho. So it's really not that bad. Do I have... How many CP do I have? 13? That's probably an upgrade we could afford. Card Watcher, Money Magnet, nu Nouveau Rich Men to start appearing around town. I kind of want that. Also, this kind of feels like either a side mission or... Ah, it's just a random encounter. We'll intervene. Why not? I'll take more money. Oh, that's not cool. <laughs> the burner that's somehow on. Straight across where the next side mission is. Can't recall exactly what. Ah, it's our it's our friend. <laughs> I don't even know if he uh God what was Bacchus. That's his name. Where you on? Were you on your way somewhere, boy? Sorry to hold you up. Uh. Yeah, you wanted to talk. That's right. Tell me, have you been training? Uh, does it count 
if we are just going beating up random people. Yeah, here and there. Good, because I have something I'd like to ask you to do. If you're willing, that is. What's with the hesitation? It's not like you. Truth is, I've got debt collectors on my tail. Scary ones. Yeah, I gathered. You've been running since we met. No, no, no. Those two-bit jokers are nickel and dime stuff. I'm talking tunas. Famous. And I mean that in the global sense. Now they're here in Japan, hot on my tail. Hold on. Did you seriously try and escape your mountain of debt by fleeing to Japan? Yes. <laughs> and this time there may be no going back. I think there's a price on my head. So I guess it's too late to pay the money back then. What are you going to do, Bacchus? Well, I was hoping I could get you to give me my bodyguard. Figured as much. Unfortunately, I've already got enough trouble on my plate. Believe me, you'd probably be in worse danger with me around. Oh no. That's no way to... Have a heart, please. Sure, I can't pay a retainer, but if you'll protect me, I'll teach you some of my top shelf moves. The good stuff. Are these moves better than your credit? Yeah. <laughs> Damn straight they are. They'll do you right in a, <laughs> in a tight fight, my boy. Are you Bacchus? Oh, man. I think they found me, boy. This is the big scary debt collector, huh? I'm here for your head. Just doing my job, so don't hold it against me. Nani. Debt collector, huh? More like Hitman. No, no. I don't want to die. Please help me, boy. <laughs> Guess I don't have much of a choice. I love to hear. It'd be like putting a bullet in your head myself. You stand back. Thanks, boy. You're protecting this guy? For now. I don't especially feel like watching him die. I see. Fine. There may not be a price on your head, but I'll see if I can swing a bonus afterwards. Hey. Watch out, boy. I don't like the look of this one. Way ahead of you. All right, let's do this. Went ahead. <laughs> Ow. Totally fine. We got shot. Everything's okay. I'm letting you live. You back and tell whoever ordered the hit to forget about Bacchus. You hear me? Heh. <laughs> Think I'm the only one after this guy? What? There'll be others on his trail soon enough. He'll get what's coming to him. Ah. Sorry, boy. Why the apology? Told you to watch out for a knife in your ribs, yet here I am putting you in danger myself. Don't worry about that. I'd rather hear more about the offer you made earlier. Oh. What? <laughs> you said you'd teach me some new moves. Better make it quick, though, before the next hitman gets here. You sure about this, boy? I don't have much choice. Like I said, I've got my own problems, so a few extra survival skills would, would come in handy. <laughs> All right. Let me fill you on some of the moves that will send those hitmen reeling. Hey, bye. <laughs> this is with the voice. <laughs> it's like the worst, like, English impression. Ready to learn my moves? Uh, sure. Why not? These are the moves I could teach you, boy. Uh, how do I break down defenses? What's the key to brawling? How about defenses? <laughs> Bonuses that stay on the defensive are a real hassle. Sometimes the right move in a boxing match is to bide your time and wait for a win by decision. But that's not the way of a true champion. You need the fighting instinct to do whatever it takes to grab the grab and wrench 
down the other guy. Fighting instinct, huh? Brawling and boxing don't have much in common, but I get what you're saying. This is the perfect move for opponents with a solid defense. I call it the face squeeze. You learn the essence of face twisting. Excuse me, what? I see. Your opponent can break free if you grab their arm or leg, but it isn't so easy when you're holding their face. Even with their guard up, you can have your way with them. Yeah. Yes, you're quick on the uptake, aren't you? Boy. Your back is, huh? <laughs> what is this going to be a revolving door? <sighs> Another assassin? I didn't mean to skip that, but whatever. Uh, where does your bodyguard here knows how to handle himself? That's why I got called in. What? Why you? Professional killers like us always uh, risk getting the tables turned on us. You often hear about second-rate uh, hitmen being taken out by their target. Yeah. Yes, and that's what happened to everyone said after me so far. Although my boy here doesn't kill them. Well, that won't be happening with me. They call me the unassailable assassin. Nobody gets past my defenses, so I always get the job done. Oh, fancy that. Uh. I get it. You want me to try out the move I just learned, right? Put your mumbling. I haven't got all day, you know. Let's go. How do we twist one's face? Slip past an enemy's guarding arms, grab their face, twist them to the ground, and stomp them to finish the job. Press Y in front of an enemy with their guard up. Um, I'm pretty sure that was, uh, that's, that's not... Pretty sure he's breaking his neck. I can hear the snaps. One more time, just in case we didn't get it. Let's have a stamina. I know. That doesn't actually do that much damage. Oh, he does attack. Here's this box of nails. Oh. I don't know if he can break guard or not. Yeah, he just breaks that within... That's amazing. He can just withstand a bike. And I don't think Rush would do anything different. <laughs> Take that. Alright, fair. There we go. See, that has a pretty large health bar, though. All in all. Oh, I can't do anything other than um, brawler style, either.
I mean, you're just gonna stand there and let me walk behind you. I'll I'll gladly take that. I don't get it. How'd you break past my defenses? However, indeed. Boy. What was that about second-rate hitmen getting taken out by their targets? You met your match today, so don't come back. I, I won't. You're getting stronger every day, boy. Uh. Yeah, I guess I have you to thank for that. Do we, though? The uh, most important thing in a fight is tenacity. That's the secret. Sounds pretty simple for a secret. So I guess in a fight, simplicity is best. Probably comes down to spirit in the end. So I'm going to teach you a move that harnesses that power. I call it spirit fire. You learn the extra resolute counter. Interesting. So you use the force of an enemy's blow to strike them back with twice the power. Yeah. I'm sure you'll be able to make use of it. You're Bacchus, right? I said revolving door. Hey. Hmm, it's one of those Japanese hooligans. Mm -hmm. Call yourself an assassin? Look about as pro as some sorry street punk. I don't know what's really going on here. I don't really know what's going on here, but I just got paid a fortune up front by some guy. I get the rest once the job's done. Oh, so he's a street fighter on a freelance job. He doesn't look so tough. Shut it. I may not look like much, but I've never lost in a fight. Time to earn this cash. Think you have the tenacity to win? It's the perfect chance, boy. Uh. Time to try out that move I just learned. What, you want some first, do you? Alright, open up and I'll serve you your own teeth. Uh, you can charge up a counterattack, then... Uh, the, you can charge up a counterattack. The attack is more powerful and likely to knock the opponent down. Do I have to get hit? The timing's kind of weird. Just tried and true. How the hell did you get the better of me? The boy wins. Boy. Hey. Yeah? What did the guy who paid you look like? It was dark, so I didn't get a good look at their face. From the way they talked, I'd guess they were foreign. No. Well, it wasn't me. Of course not. It was the guy who was out to get you. Don't you go getting any more big ideas, okay? Yeah, I hear you. Just, just casually walks away after that. Nice. Oh. 
Hmm, I've heard these are the most dangerous debt collectors around. Looks like you handle this one no problem, though. We better hope they're all like this, then. Alright, two out of five moves. I assume this is all we can learn for now. Hey, bye. Oh, boy. <laughs> it's like, it's like a toy without batteries. Like, they just modulated his voice to be... <laughs> slower and slower. Ah, we can meet up with uh, Tachibana. Well, Oda from Tachibana. Well, let's let's go over here. Actually, let's save first. Actually, let's be a good. This could be a good Samaritan. Not the one I wanted to grab. Works out just the same, though. Slightly battered Swiss watch. Just what I needed. Hop over to the burger joint. Oh, that's not the door. This is the door. Free smile? Wow. We're here. Let's get a smile shake. Stewed pork burger, tuna burger, king smile scent. Well, stewed burger it is. You're not supposed to eat the paper. <laughs> That's what it sounded like. Alright, he's got nothing, and it's fine. There is one more... Oh, right, the Don Quixote with um, everybody waiting in line. Uh, let's do that first. I'm so glad I lined up first this thing this morning. I'm going to be the first to get it. Okay. No cutting in line, pal. You have to play by the rules uh, and get the back of line like everyone else. Tell me what you're waiting for, though. I snuck off from for from work for this. My manager finds out before I get back. I'm so dead. Boy. Hey, kid. Uh -huh. Yes? What's going on? Why are all these people here? Um, did you want one too? I'm really sorry, but they said I'll get the last one in stock. What are you talking about? Huh? Aren't you lining up for Ara Q3? Ara Q3? Ara Q3? Like some kind of secret code? No, it's Ara Q3, the newest game in the Ara Kure series. Ara Q3 is short for Ara Kure 3. Uh, quest for the Quantum Quill. That's a tongue twister. 
Can't wait to read the instruction manual on my way home. Remember when games had instruction manuals? I remember. So people are actually uh, lining up to buy a video game. Um, <laughs> what an amazing world we live in. Yeah, it's the most popular game in Japan right now. I was looking for it with Papa, but they were sold out everywhere. Then my friend told me this place was getting a new batch today. So I grabbed my allowance and ran all the way here. I made it just in time and got the last reservation ticket. I'm so happy. It's going to be the best game ever made. Times are strange if it's this hard to buy a toy. Sorry to bug you, kid. Thanks for the info. Yep. Bye, mister. Okay. Oh. Hey, Rude. Thanks for uh, that uh, subscription. <laughs> You're the winner. <laughs> As the first to... Notice and subscribe. What do you win? I don't know. Other than my, my gra gratitude, of course. Freaking ads. I'm going to try and fix that. I didn't... I was trying to use this as a test. Um. <laughs> anyway... So yeah, I was going to try to use this as a test. That's why I haven't said anything. Because I didn't know exactly how the entire thing flowed during a stream. So thank you, Rude. And uh, congratulations. That's how I noticed. Yeah, I... So there's a little timer on the right. And then when I take my first break, I'm going to probably roll a three minute. Just to see if that will just then disable the pre-rolls. I'm hoping that's how it works. If if I can't figure it out or I can't get a good rhythm in, then I will not be doing this for long. <laughs> well, enjoy your emotes. I think they got approved. It looked like they got approved. There you go. Hey, not bad for somebody who doesn't do art, right? The Lurk one I, I is still under review, and uh, I think the Easy one is also under review. For reasons unknown. Like, some of them got instantly approved, the other ones had to wait. Anyway, <laughs> thank you very much for the sub, Rude. Uh, you are, if you didn't hear me before, you are the first. Also, everybody just disappeared that was outside. Twitch told you who you were? Ah. Well, I, I'm telling you the same, and congrats for that. And thank you again. I decided that it got to a point where I was like, there's stuff I want to build, and I can't do it without, without the systems in place to do so. So I'm like, even because there's no way to evaluate it, or anything like that. So this is a... I'm going to call it a trial run. But I am going to work towards getting everything filled out, like badges and all that stuff. So that's the next uh, That's the next goal for me.
All right, let's, uh, this kid's probably getting shaken down for the video game he just tried to buy. We're going to beat the shit out of this guy, no doubt. Mm, isn't that? <laughs> game over, loser. Oi. Hey, you're the kid uh, who has lined up for that game, right? Did you manage to get it? Oh, m mister. What's the matter? Something wrong? Y yes, my brand new video game. Th that guy stole it. Daddy. What? Wait, you mean that high school kid who just left? Uh-huh. He just ran up and yelled at me to hand it over. He took it. My RQ3. I spent all morning in line two waiting. <laughs> I was waiting in line too. I, I saved up my allowance for a really, really long time to get it. Now it's gone. Stealing from a little boy? That's really low. Boy. Hey kid, what's your name? It's it's Akio. Akio. Got it. Hang tight, Akio. Hang tight, Akio. I'll get your game back. Huh? You will? So there's no need to cry. M Mister. Okay. I won't cry anymore. Ah, oh, look at you, Kiryu. Model parent. That's good. Showing that's showing some spine, little man. I like that. Leave it to me. Yay, thank you, mister. That high school delinquent ran off towards Pink Street with Akio's Arakure game. Some uh, meme emotes of fr from past streams. <laughs> what do you mean? That I should make meme emotes from past streams, or are you just mean? I'm not sure what you, not sure what you're trying to say. All right, there's our target. He's probably he's already he's already selling it. Well, we can't have that. Isn't that <laughs> Gang Goomba? Later, freak. No oh, fair. I've been defeated. Wait, is this a domino effect? No doubt about it. That's the kid who took Akio's game. Oi. Hey, you. You have that Arakiri game, don't you? Huh? What's it to you? My adventure just came to an abrupt end, so leave me alone. No can do. I'll take back uh, the, uh, that Arakure you took from Akio. RQ3? That's something I want to hear about right now. Forget it. I'm going to grind your ass just for the experience. Sure you are. Sure you are. Just let, get up so I can hit you with this sign. Thank you. <laughs> Mister. This is how you enact violence. Learn, learn, my child. I just caught the guy who took your Arakure. Oh, yay. Okay, give Akio his Arakure back. Look, man, I don't have it. Give it up already. If you don't want another beating, hand it over and get a job next time you want a video game. Told you, I don't have it. I got robbed by a better thief than me. Daddy. What? You were robbed too? But yeah. Stir from a street gang busted out his dagger of stealing and maybe give it to him. Let's see where this is going. Dagger of stealing. A gang member? You mean the, that guy who was just here? Ugh. Yeah, lame. I could be at home leveling up, but now my RQ3 is probably going to some dude who's not even a fan. Uh? Excuse me? Your RQ, your RQ3? That RQ3 wasn't yours. <laughs> Close in zoom. You rob a little kid and then turn around and cry like a baby when you get mugged? How pathetic is that? 
You haven't learned your lesson yet. Uh, you want another class? Eh, no. I'm already out of lives. S sorry, man. I'm out of here. My RQ3. <laughs> Don't worry, Akio. I'll get it back for you. I promise. Mister. Okay. Got it. Yeah, so don't cry like a little... Never mind. So the kid who stole Akio's RQ3 had it stolen by some thug. And that guy went off towards Taihei Boulevard East. Picking on a, a kid punk. I was about picking your boogers for a change. <laughs> That's what that kid's probably going to do afterward. So now I just go, you know, beating up the next person in line. This dude's, yeah, this dude's going to get mugged by somebody else. I, like I said, I knew where this was going. And also, to, to answer your other guy, yeah, the emotes that involve past streams and inside jokes, just suggesting, absolutely. I don't know how to... I you just gave me an idea, but I don't know how to execute it. <laughs> I'll think on it. Here we go again. Later, loser. Damn it. Imagine not even having a name. You just get called a Goomba. No doubt about it. That's the thug who stole, stole our, who took our carry from the kid who stole the game from Akio. Oi. Hey, you're the guy who stole the from the kid who stole it from Akio, aren't you? Uh. Eh? Who the hell's Akio? And, and so what if I did? I saw my chance. I took it. That was Akio then? Yeah. No. You robbed the kid who robbed Akio of his Arakure. Uh. I don't get it. Forget it. Just give back that Arakiri cartridge you stole. RQ3? RQ3? I don't want to hear another word about RQ3. I'm going to stop you flat, Pops. Not with this dagger of stealing. I love it when the money flies out. <laughs> Shit, looks like I'm the one who got stomped. Mister! <laughs> hey, Akio. I just caught the wannabe punk who stole your RQ3 from that nerdy high school kid. Uh, okay. I don't get it, but that's great. Alright, give Akio his RQ3. Sorry, pal, but your game got pinched. I'm not playing around. Get the kid his game or you could suffer some more. I'm serious. It's really gone. Some hill got the jump on me. Nani. What? You were robbed too? Uh, uh yeah. This hard ass Yakuza type held me at gunpoint and forced me to give it to him. Then took off. Mm. Yakuza type? And the guy was just here? <sighs> uh huh. What a shitty day I'm having. The Yakuza guy jacked my RQ3. He's probably not even a fan. Uh? Your RQ3? The game wasn't yours to begin with. What? <laughs> you still from a kid and then cry like a little baby when you get mugged? I'm seeing a pathetic pattern here. This isn't getting through to you. How about we go another round? <laughs> nope, I'm good. I'm really sorry. My RQ3. <laughs> Don't worry, Akio. I promise. I'll hunt it down for you. Uh. Mister? Okay. Got it. So the thug who took Akio's RQ3 from the kid who stole it in the first place ended up having to take it by some hard-ass Yakuza who went off towards Taihei Boulevard. My head hurts. <laughs> I was expecting the explanation to be, like, twice as convoluted. Oh, 
Uh, if I could turn around and put that on the other guy, that would be great. And smash. <laughs> Stop blocking the sidewalk now. At least have the common decency. Uh, oh yeah, Taihei Boulevard East, right? So other way, actually. We're essentially doing... Uh. Alright, this way. I don't remember what that guy looked like, though. Not you. Eh, let's be a good Samaritan. goes our untouchable bonus. Yes, give me my premium plate. You say Taihei or just... Um, I should probably read instead of just blitzing through the text. Okay, it went off towards Taihei Boulevard. So it is this way. <laughs> You're finally mine, RQ3. My quest is complete. Oi. Hey, that game you got there. Oh. What's that, fool? You one of the losers who couldn't score an RQ3? That's some tough luck. For you see, this RQ3 belongs to us. <laughs> you want to live? Get off my street. And listen, don't bother looking for a place that's still selling RQ3. Just find a fool, bought one, and take it. Villains, every last one. What's this world coming to? Huh? Bah, what'd you say, boy? That Arakiri, taking it back. What's that? Take it back. Don't act like it was your game to start with. <laughs> Shut up, it's complicated. Oh, I see. You're an RQ 3 Hunter 2, then. Playtime is over. I'm not holding back, either. Welcome to your doom. Nice. Welcome to your doom is the, what the boss says in every level of the game, Altered Beast. Fun fact. That gun's not going to help you now, man. Not one bit. <laughs> no, this cannot be. 
I'll be taking the RQ3 with me. H hold on. Please. I need that. Give it back. Come on. Give it back. This was never yours to begin with. Bella, I'm begging you. Please. My little boy's really been looking forward to playing it. Your son? Uh, yeah. My old lady left me and, uh, took the boy with her. He's been wanting an RQ3 ever since he read about it. We went looking everywhere. There ain't none for sale anywhere. Just wanted my boy to be happy. Bella, I'm begging here. You gotta let me have it. Please? I get the picture now. Sorry, but I can't do that. You probably don't know this, but a little kid saved up his allowance and went through a lot of trouble to buy the last copy of this RQ3. Uh. Eh? I didn't stick up no little kid. I got some, took it off some worthless goon. Uh. That's right. You got the game from a punk. That game belonged to a little kid first. Long story short, you took RQ3 from a wannabe punk who took it from a high school bully who took it from the last boy in line who bought it in the first place. My head hurts just thinking about it. But, alright. So that's what happened. I came to get it back for the little kid. It's going back to the rightful owner. I'm sorry. Bella, I'm the fool here. Give it back to that kid for me. Damn, I was about to make someone else's kid cry for the sake of my own. What kind of monster have I become? Thought I could make my boy happy with something I stole from someone else. I was wrong. Plot twist, the kid's gonna be his son. How am I supposed to be a good dad to my boy? To Akio like this? How did I know? How did I know? It's almost like these games play out similarly. <laughs> I guess you'd better think about that. Wait, what? Akio? Oh, hi, mister. Perfect timing, Akio. I just got your RQ3 back. Oh, really? Yippee. Huh? Akio, it's you. My Akio. Oh, hi, Papa. Daddy. P Papa? You guys are related? That's right. Are you friends with Papa, mister? Uh, yeah, you might say that. <laughs> sure. Wait, buddy. That little kid you were telling me about, that RQ3 was what Akio bought with his own money, and I tried to... That seems to be how this is shaking out. But why? Akio, why'd you say anything to your Papa? All you had to do was ask. I could have given you the money to buy RQ3 any time. But because Mom always gets mad at you, Papa, for spending money on golfing, go-karts, board games, and prostitutes. <laughs> oh, never mind. Was I not supposed to fill in the blanks? I didn't want Mama to get mad at you for even more for spending all your money again. So I tried to buy it by myself. A Akio... Mister, Papa looks kind of scary, but he's really he's a really, really nice man once you get to know him. He took me to a bunch of game stores just the other day. Papa's not living with Mama and me now. I think he's lonely. So please stay friends with him, okay? Actually, Akio, your Papa helped me get your RQ3 back. Really? Thank you, Papa. I did. In a way. Akio, I don't want to see you crying again. Be careful going home with your game. Uh. Yep, got it. Thank you, mister. Mister, thanks. This is to apologize. Or to thank you for teaching this fool a lesson, maybe. Whatever. I want you to have it. You got a sunburst. Damn. Okay. We're just we're just kinda getting handed a blade. Sure, why not? From now on, be a good dad all the time. Not just in front of Akio. You don't want any. You want anything to do that'll. Uh, you want to do anything to make kids sad, no matter what the whose kids they are. Yep, you got that right. Papa, this is too far, hard for me by myself. Let's go to Mama's house and play RQ3 together. I need help with the maps. Uh, sure. My expert advice. We'll be making a beeline toward the to that nasty demon lord in no time. <laughs> Now that's how a game should be played.
All right, now that we did that extremely long, convoluted side quest, perhaps it's time to go and uh, actually let's pawn. Actually, let's go down here. We'll go to Bisu Pawn, sell off the premium plate and the watch. Hmm. I'm exhausted. Is there any other answer? <laughs> now. None that are valid, anyway. Yes, I must say. All right, sell Swiss watch and the premium plate for a cool, like, was that 3 million, something like that? I see, I see now how we could potentially get some money. Yeah, now we have 18 million. I was, I was questioning, like, how the hell do you get 18 million or 30 million for some of these skills? And it's like, oh, that's how. I think I'm good on healing items. You'll be getting some cash. I hope so. Just get to work. Well, the work option has not been presented to us yet. It kind of was for Majima in the, like, sending people on international missions and, and whatnot. but didn't get too far into it. よ、来たか。待ちくたびれたぜ。どうだ。さんが抜けてるぞ、おい。上司呼び捨てにするやつがどこにいるんだ。大体お前その服なんだよ。ちゃんとしろっつったろ。全然肩気に見えねえじゃねえか。あんたに言われてねえよ。あ。あれ。そうか。他にもっとマシな教育係はいねえのか。立場の不動産に。バカ言うなって。俺以外の誰がお前の手
それじゃあその戦友やを力づくで追い出すのが俺らの仕事ってことかいやそうはいかないんだか弱いビルの住人たちは法律で守られているんでね力づくで行けば警察沙汰になるその時捕まるのはもちろんこっちだけだおかしな話だろ結局ビルの買い手は理不尽な金を払わねえと専用屋を追い出せねえんだ確かになけどその金をなるべく払わずに済ませたいってのが今回の俺たちへのオーダーだじいさんそろそろ来ると思うんだが先に店に入ってるかおっとその前にこれ渡すの忘れてた桐生君の名刺だよこれであんたも立派な立場の不動産の社員だないいか今日はお前のサラリーマンとしての適性を測るあんまりなめたまねするようならきちんと社長に報告するからなわかったいらっしゃいませお好きな席へどうぞ Anywhere I like, huh? Where's it good to talk business? Table in the front? Business? Not talked up in the front. Table at the back, table near the back. Let's go near the back, not all the way back. This looks as good as any. Yes. この場所なら問題ないだろう。仕事の話をするのにおあつらえに来た。ええ、バーディスシート。おい、まさか神座に座ろうなんて思ってないよな。It's a square table. 入り口に近い方が下座で遠い方が神座。俺たちが座るのは当然下座だ。それくらい知ってる。知ってても実行できなきゃ意味ないんだからな。椅子に座るときは常に気をつけるようにしとけよ。Take the seat close to the door. Yep, got it. いらっしゃいませ。ご注文はお決まりでしょうかああ、そうだ。コーヒーを。いや、注文は連れが来てからにする。また後で頼むよ。かしこまりました。先に注文する気だったんじゃねえだろうな。客を待ちながら優雅にコーヒーなんざすすってちゃ話になんねえぞ。それがビジネスマナーってもんだ。そういうもんか。別に期待しちゃいなかったけどよ。せめて同じことは二度言わせんな。ええ、しかしめんどくせえな。何言ってんだい。ヤクザの方がよっぽど礼儀にうるせえぞ。上の人間ほどわきまえてるもんだ。お,おい、来たぞ。あのじいさんが今日の客だ。どうも、山根さん。お久しぶりです。ああ、悪いね、小田さん。なんか、面倒なことになっちゃって。こちらはうちの新人で桐生です。山井さんよりご依頼の件、こいつがやらせていただきますんで。へえ、そうですか。立花不動産の桐生です。いいぞ。名刺交換は挨拶の基本だ。どんなに顔を打っても名刺を渡し忘れるようじゃ。その先の取引にはつながらないからな。だが、残念。名刺が逆さまだ。<笑>まあ、初めてにしちゃ上出来だ。多めに見といてやるよ。キリュウさんですか
これからよろしくお願いしますよこちらこそよろしくお願いいたしますなるほどお話聞く限り相手は典型的な戦友屋ですね山井さんがそのビル落札したのは先月でしたかすると戦友屋が居座り出したのはその直前ええまあ戦友屋は一人ですねはい辻って男です四十過ぎくらいかななんだかホームレスみたいな汚らしいやつでしてそいつから立ち抜き料の要求はありましたかまだですできればそのあたりの交渉も全部立花さんとこにお願いできればと思ってまして私も年寄りですし怖くてねなんとかうまいことあいつを追い出してもらえませんかもちろんです時に山野井さん戦友屋への立ち抜き料いくらまでと考えてます早いとこ済ませたいですしそうですね500万くらいなら500万勝手に座ってるだけのやつにかそれはまあ安く済めばそれに越したことはないですけどもともとあんたがそいつに金出す筋はねえんだ俺ならビタ一文払う気になれねえなおい失礼だその辻って男自分にはヤクザがついているなんていうもんで揉めるとあとは怖いんですよお察ししますでもご安心くださいうちの気流はヤクザを扱うエキスパートですからあヤクザのエキスパートいやーこいつはなんていうかちょっと気合の入ったヤクザオタクでしてね時々ヤクザになりきっちゃあえつに言ってるんですよな気流くんああそうだなま立ち抜き料はできるだけ安く済ませますよそれじゃあ頼めますかもちろんあなた方への謝礼は別に用意しますからあそれはありがたいんですが立花から謝礼は遠慮するようにと言われてますいつも山井さんにはお世話になってますから本当ですかいやーさすが立花不動産だやることが生きたねで問題のビルというのはどちらに天下一通りにある杉田ビルですわかりましたあとは我々にお任せくださいな桐生くんああは分かったな要するに戦友屋をビルから立ち退かせろってことだま交渉は俺がやるよ仕事の手本を見せてやるからな戦友屋のバックにはヤクザがついてんだろ交渉だけで済むのかそこは俺の腕の見せ所だな差し当たってキリュ君に最初の任務をやろうなんだ一っ走り菓子折り買ってきてくれあ相手が専用屋にしても手ぶらで交渉ってわけにいかねえだろうこれもビジネスマナーってやつだまたそれがわかったよ菓子折り買ったら杉田ビルの前に来てくれ俺は先に行って待ってるからそれじゃまた後でなああ He said this Sigita building was on Tenkaichi Street. Can't say the name rings any bells, though. That whole area is Dojima family turf, so I know it pretty well. But I don't remember any place like that. Might be tucked away on one of the smaller streets off Tenkaichi. I'll look once I get this gift. I've got this gift box. All right. <laughs> Now that the cutscene's over. Welcome, in, Shaquille. Uh, Winston, when the video games educate you on about business etiquette until. 
You know, today, today we learned. Today we learned I'm a, you know, dirty pleb who can't even negotiate business properly. But hope you're doing well. And, uh, yeah, no worries about the, uh, achievement thing, because that's impossible to know on your first playthrough. It's a confectionery box. Uh... Oops. That's what I thought he was going to say. Uh, confectionery box. Where am I going to find that? The full Fujisoba. Smile Burger. Now, these are all activities. Maybe... I don't think it would be at a Papo. I think it would probably be at Don Quixote, maybe? I don't immediately remember seeing one, but... They have a lot of random odds and ends. Kiryu is literally the blunt instrument of the of the uh, real estate world. speed battery. Yeah, these are all... Um... What else do we have? We have, uh... Imported brands? I don't know. I swear that's closed, but you never know. Out of my way. Yeah, clones, switch watches, all sorts of other stuff for fancy people. Oh, before I forget, I need to do something. So I don't forget. Although now I have to fix that alert. Because I... <laughs> well. Yeah, I know. I, I, I did it today. Old-fashioned ramen shop, drugstore... Uh, drugstore? Probably not. I guess you have a subscriber now? I have, I have two. Uh, Rude happened to notice earlier. I see his icon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I need to get badges. I'm still working on that. I got I got the emotes approved, but I need to work on the badges. So I have an idea for her. 
We're just gonna make the whole lap around Camarocho. Looking for a damn confectionery box. Yeah. I should have gone that way, apparently. I'm busy, guys. Can't you see that? Um, yep, keep going. <laughs> they give up pretty quickly, thankfully. One more ball. The secret is out. Yeah, I was, uh... I was going to be maybe a little more subtle about it, but as soon as... I mean, it's it's very apparent as soon as you see an ad. But I didn't want... Definitely didn't want a moderator to have those. Goal is to try and run ads when I walk away on, like, for my hourly breaks. Uh, collect confection gift box. Here we go. Maybe we should buy something else while we're here. Ads my favorite. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's that's the sh that's the shitty part. So now I have a little like timer on my dashboard that tells me when uh, how long it will delay pre-roll ads. So, that's the thing I don't want. And that's the, like, the ultimate goal is to not have pre-rolls for anybody who comes into the stream. Because there's nothing worse as a, for a first impression than being met with ads. I don't want to really, I don't want to make money off of them. Like, even from, like, subscribers and stuff, I, you know, the entire point of that is to just reinvest anything I would get into the channel anyway. Not that I expect, you know, a lot from it to begin with. God damn, these guys are all about the fucking combos. It's all about the mercies days. Can I get many V plushies? You can get a you can get a tinsel pig plushie. I feel like that would actually sell. Fuck you! I just wanted the bike. All right, he's not he's not gonna let me do it. Fine, I'll actually try. Pricks. Alright, take your damn... Actually, I feel like this is going to end up in a fight, so let me save, and then we'll give Oda his box of sweets. ちゃんと貸し寄りは買ってきたかええ、これでいいんだろうよし、さすがにこれくらいはやってくれなきゃなで、ここが問題の過ぎたビルだここに専用屋が居座っているってわけかああ、それじゃ行くぞ。ああ、お手並み拝見と行こうか。まあ見てな。
この部屋らしいなすみません辻さんいます山井さんの代理で参りましたたちばな不動産のもんですがねたちばな不動産あとこれつまらないものですけどおい勝手に何すんだゴミだらけじゃ立ち抜くの大変じゃないですか立ち抜くなんだよそれ俺は立ち抜く気なんかねえぞそうは言ってもねこのビルはもう山井さんが新しいオーナーになったわけだからそれをあんたがいつまでも立ち抜いてくれないって困ってんですよ民法395条はいあんたも不動産屋なら勉強しなたとえ抵当権が設定された不動産でも短期賃貸借の場合抵当権者に対抗することができる要するに俺は法律に守られてここにいるんだなんなら出るとこ出るか硬いこと言わないでくださいよ立ち退いてくれるなら引っ越し費用はこっちで持ちますここの物件と同程度のとこをうちでご紹介しますよあのな俺はここが気に入ってんだよそうやって何でも金で解決しようってのは感心しないね立ち退き料目当ての戦友屋がよく言うな何だよ戦友屋っててめえ言いがかりつける気かねえ辻さん茶番はよしませんか新しいオーナーさんとしてはさっさとこんなボロビル転売して人儲けしたいわけですそんなもんそっちの都合だろお前ら下っ端じゃ話になんねそのオーナー連れてこいやあだったらそっちもさっさとバックにいるヤクザ出したらどうですヤクザ何の話かわからねえなだからそんな猿芝居はいらねえってんだよ部屋に居座るだけが脳のチンピラがでけえ口叩くな,なんだとあんたごときにオーナーは出てこねえよバックのヤクザに伝えとけお前らの交渉相手はこの立花不動産だってなあんま調子に乗んなよ不動産や風情がそれじゃ要件は伝えましたよ辻さん。最初はこんなところだろうな<笑>ずいぶん荒っぽい交渉だったじゃねえかビジネスマナーってのはどこに忘れてきたんだ仕事ってのは使い分けが大事なんだよ大体いいあの辻って戦友屋はうちの交渉相手じゃねえまずは本物の交渉相手を引きずり出さねえとな本物の交渉相手バックにいるヤクザかああ結局向こうも金が目当てなんだよお互いぶっちゃけたあとはさっさと話し進めようってことになるなんだこいつらは眠いねえキリュウ君本物の交渉相手だろ早速反応があったってことだおたくらが立場の不動産って人たち山野井さんの代理だって聞いたけどあんたはおたくらの味方ですよ杉田ビルの戦友屋に困ってるんでしょええまあねそれうちが話しつけてあげるよそしたら彼すぐに立ち退いてくれるからなるほどその仲介料としてうちはあんたらにいくら払えばいいんです
話が早いねさすがカムロ町の不動産屋だそうだな700万ってところがあのビル転売したら奥は儲けが出るでしょう700万って良心的だと思うねほんの少し部屋に居座っただけで700万あんたら楽して儲けすぎでしょう楽して儲けてんのはお互い様だ今時の不動産屋は濡れ手で上がるだからってあんたらに払う金はないよただそれでもあんたらには専用屋に口聞いてもらうへえどうやってだもちろん力ずくでだよねっキリュウ君おだあんた鼻からこういう筋書きだったのかまあねでも新入社員の初仕事にしちゃ相手の数が多すぎたかいやそうでもねえさちっしろ余計な手間かけさせやがるこの手間賃も仲介料に上乗せするぞ<笑>その手間賃ってのはいくらだ300万合わせて1000万だスクワッターズ、プリシュレー、ヤクズ、ブッグ。町には星の数ほどヤクザの組があるのによ。よりによって、道島組の下っ端だったわけか。まずいとこにぶつかっちまったな。もっとも、俺らが空の一つを追ってりゃいずれ勝ち合う相手だ。いい挨拶代わりになったんじゃないのまだそのビルに座るつもりならさっきの話の続きするかいあいやそのあんたの後ろ盾は見ての通りだよ辻さんそれでもまだ一人で頑張る気い,いえめそうもないあそうそれじゃ今夜中にあの部屋出てってね明日の朝までいたらこの桐生くんが何してかすかわかんないよこ今夜中に立ち退かせていただきますすすいませんでしたこれがあんたの仕事のやり方ってわけか俺のじゃない全部立花社長から教わったやり方だよま、最初の仕事にしては上出来か
どう極道やるよりよっぽど楽しかったろうカバギの人間からも感謝されるしな俺が極道になったのは仕事を楽しむためじゃねえさお前もしかして殻の一つを手に入れたら極道に戻る気かそんな先のこと考えてねえよそっかそれよりこの後はどうするああ問題の戦友屋は追い出したお前は山の井のじいさんに報告頼むそれが済んだら天下一通りのセレナって店に来てくれここのすぐ近くだセレナ何の店だただの小さなクラブだよ安心しな今度は仕事じゃないささやかながら今日の打ち上げと行こうじゃないの俺のおごりだ案外気前がいいんだなまあねその代わり山の井さんへの報告はお前一人で頼むわあのじいさんマイボールでボーリングするのは日課でねマッハボールに行けば会えるはずだマッハボールかわかったそれじゃまた後でなボーリングミニゲームタイム Perhaps. Oh. We're kind of locked into it anyway. Nah, that's just pocket tissues. I'm always a mock bowl just up ahead. Yeah, so I need to move on for this day. I'm on the GG. Hmm. 自分の物件なんてもうほとんど残ってない状態なのにあれだけ圧力かけられてもまだ抗うとはまったくだしかし今回は体にみっちり教え込んでやったからないい加減次は落ちるだろう山の井さえいなくなればあのエリア一帯は娯楽王とまで呼ばれている設楽さんのものになったも同然ですからね<笑>まあそうなるなこれでファイブビリオネアの他の連中にもでかい顔ができるってもんやウィーザーキング5ビリオネアスあなたはウィーザーキングパンツパンツおっとてめえ何つったってやがるまあまあいいじゃねえか俺は今日はもう人を殴る気分じゃねえんださっき殴り疲れちまったからねそれに俺って器が広いからよ見逃してやるよ兄ちゃん金持ち喧嘩せずってもしな<笑>怖い顔した兄ちゃんだなじゃあねもう二度と俺の前に立つんじゃねえぞおい行こうぜは,はい Who the hell was that? His little pet called him the Leisure King with a straight face They definitely mentioned Yamanoi though And I don't like what I heard I'll need to check up on him right away
すみませんねありがとうございました戦友屋の件も無事片付けてくれたみたいでいやそれは別に構わんそれより大丈夫なのかええおかげさまで大した傷じゃないですよ<笑>しかし一体どうしたというんだ実はうちを潰そうとしている連中がいましてねそいつらの要求を断り続けていたらやられちゃって<笑>あんたを潰そうとしている連中もしかして娯楽王とかなんとかいうやつらかえっ桐生さんどうしてそれをさっき向かう途中で絡まれてな山の家を消すだの殴っただの物騒なことを言っていたからもしやと思ったんだそうですか一体何なんだあの娯楽王ってのは娯楽王パチンコ経営をはじめとした娯楽産業で成り上がった億万長者ですファイブビリオネアの一人と言われていますファイブビリオネア今、カムロ町で最も多くの金を動かしていると言われる五輪の億万長者の総称です。娯楽王の他にも、風俗王、電脳王、賭博王、芸能王と呼ばれる億万長者たちが、カムロ町の物件に次々と手をつけ始めているんです。その圧倒的な資金力と、金をばらまいて従えた悪い連中たちを使った圧力と暴力でねそんな奴らがいたのか知らなかった彼ら5人はカムロ町を5つのエリアに分けそれぞれを自分のものにしようとしていますうちに目をつけている娯楽王はその中の一つであるこの天下一通りエリアを手に入れようとしているというわけです私も多少ですがこの辺りの有力な物件を所有していますから娯楽王はそれを狙って私をなるほどな奴らを狙いはあんた自身ではなくあんたの所有する物件ということかしかしなぜ連中はそんなに物件を欲しがるんだ詰まるところ金儲けですマネーゲームを楽しむためですよ現在の異常なまでの景気で物件や土地は転がせば転がすだけ金が儲かるまさにうちでの小づちです東洋一の歓楽街カムロ町の物件は特にね彼らはゲームで大いに力を発揮してくれるそんな優秀な駒を何としても手に入れたい物件を駒扱いかだがその駒には懸命に働いている奴らや平和に暮らしている奴らがいるわけだろうもちろんだが彼らは自分たちの儲けばかりを考えてそこで生きる人々やカモロ町という町のことを一切考えていない彼らのマネーゲームに巻き込まれて悲惨な目に遭っている人たちがすでに大勢いる私は何とかしてそれを食い止めたいこの異常な景気で日本は豊かになったように見えるだがいつかはこの景気の波にも終わりが来ると私は思っているその時カムロ町はこのままマネーゲームで引っかき回され続ければ雑草一本生えない荒れ地になってしまいかねない、うん、私も長くこの町と共に生きてきた男カムロ町が大好きだだからこの町をそんなことにはさせたくないそのために抗ってきたんですがさすがにこの老体には荷が重すぎたようだもう限界ですかなそう言わずにもう少し頑張れないのかそんな奴らの金遊びのためにカムロ町を荒らされるなんてたまったもんじゃないぜもちろん私もカムロ町をあいつらから奪い返して昔の健全な状態に戻したいという思いはあるだがファイブビリオネアには膨大な金があるし
暴力に訴えかけることもできるこの老体にはそれがないくそなんとかならんもんなのかフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフフ私が手に負えなかったところをあなたはすぐに解決してくれたそんなあなたがこの事務所を継いでくれればもしかしたら彼らに一矢報いることができるかもしれない何言ってんだ買いかぶりすぎだ俺には経営能力もなければ経験もない誰でも最初はそうです難しく考えないでいい私もあなたにお願いする以上できる限りの協力をさせてもらうつもりですご安心にそれにこの任務は不動産のいろはを学ぶ上でもきっといい経験になると思いますよ別に失敗しても構いませんどうせ遅かれ早かれこのまま行けばこの事務所が潰れてしまう運命だしかし別に俺じゃなくても他に適任そうなやつがいるんじゃないかなかなか桐生さんほどの男はいないと思うがねそれに私はあなたを信頼しているんですよあなたが思っている以上にねなぜだ桐生さんあなた風間慎太郎という男を知っているねえあなたは風間さんが経営する施設の出だそうですねつまり彼はあなたにとって育ての親だそして堂島組の若衆として杯を受けた今もその恩を忘れず風間慎太郎を親として慕い続けているあんた一体どうしてそれを誰か信頼できる人間はいないかと探す私にあなたを推薦してくれたんですよ立花さんが立花がええ、くれぐれも内密にと念を押された上であなたのことをいろいろと話してくれましたということはつまりさっきの話は全部立花も承知の上ってことかええ立花さんもあなたがこの仕事を継ぐにふさわしい人物だと思っているんでしょうあんた風間のおやすさんのことを知っているような口ぶりだがどういう関係なんだ<笑>昔ちょっとね詳しくは言えないが一つだけ言えるとしたら風間さんは私がこの世で最も信頼している男だということですそんな風間さんを慕う昔の仮にそっくりのギラギラとしたしかし綺麗な目をしている男になら私のすべてを託してみてもいいかなと思いましてね、うん、お願いできませんか桐生さん今のカムロ町にはあなたのような男が必要なんですわかったそこまで言うなら勉強のつもりでやらせてもらおう失敗しても恨みっこなしたぜもちろん一つよろしくお願いしますよキリオさんはい、no time like the present let's get you up to speed on the basics of our business but、hmm, it's a bit distracting with this place in such shambles I'll call my secretary help me straighten up secretary? didn't know you had one Oh, yes. I'll introduce you later. She's quite the charmer, and I think you'll agree, Kiryu-san. So, can I ask you to step out a bit while I get the office put together? Shouldn't take too long. Alright. Yamanoi's、yeah, cleaning up his office. I should go for a stroll and then check back later. Basically, just go 
piss off for a little bit. But I will use this opportunity to go save. But yeah, typically I, I know a few artists. I just don't know any, like, ones that focus on either will, will or willing to do or focus on pixel art. I'm not looking for anything, like, super fancy. I just... I just, I just know that I'm limited in what I can do. While it's a fun learning experience for me, at the same time, I realize I have, you know, I have my own limitations and mostly in the form of time. Oh yeah, we're just supposed to run around and wait for them to call. So we could go to the batting cages or something like that. Mess around like that. Or Sega Land Mahjong, which I don't know how to play. Chat with friendly girls. Yeah, let me let me get right on that. Bowling. Go to the batting center or at least start running that way. I wouldn't be shocked if we got a call, or a page call. Can't be called. It's only the pager, because it's 1988. There's Mr. Shakedown, which I want no part of right now. Wait, how did? Wait, what? I'm I'm so confused at what just happened. That dude punched me in the back of the head and then got knocked out and started bleeding. What in the world? <laughs> All right. I'm not complaining. It was just an interesting little occurrence. Sure. Let's see what kind of cool prizes you have. Steel Shin Guards, Metal Bat, Tornier Plus Plus, Patriarch's Bat, move, Immovable Belt, Toughness. I told the boss that offering expensive prizes like these is going to ruin us, but he never listened to his staff. Go ahead and win them all. That'll show him. It's 300 yen for the intermediate course. Do I want to play? So is this a beginner course? I know it's the same as always, but gotta get used to it. What? This is weird. Well, this is... 
This is way different and weird. Pulling the most epic desktop background pick ever. You'll have to share it. Oh, too early. Shit. C. Oh, so we actually want... Yeah, that's just weird. 17-bit sounds good. Try that again. In the later iterations, it's either the home run derby course or the um I can't even remember what the other one is, but it's it's a more variety. I can't I couldn't even see the ball for where I was aiming. If you're if you're early on swings, it it doesn't matter. <laughs> That's much more weird. That is pretty fancy, I must say. This is worse than that Mario Party mini game. It kind of is. <laughs> I mean, it's one of those things you get it. You can get used to it, but. Um... Uh, Francis, what is that a picture of? Or what is that a illustration of? Or is it just, you know, art in general? I mean, obviously it is, but, like, what is it? Drakengard ending E. Okay. I know nothing of Drakengard, so... That would explain it, but... That totally makes sense in terms of that whole universe. Very cool. You don't need to? No, I... Yeah. All right, we'll do this one more time. I did way better the first time, just aiming for home runs every time. You know what any E does, right? Nope. Fuck this for right now. <laughs> it's the intro to the nearest series. Something is actually not mentioned in the game, so it's really not a spoiler unless you plan on playing Drakengard. Yeah, I knew it was the like the spiritual success, like Nier's like spiritual successor of of sorts. I don't know if there's an actual connection or not, and uh, it might be a little too late in the game for me to to go and play Drakengard. There's our pager. Uh, 89 is all set when 01104 is come by. Guess he's done. Guess he's done cleaning.
Just throw the punches as fast as possible. They can't hit you if you've hit them 15 times. Probably cutscene time. Marina. Pleased to meet you. I'm uh, Marina. Yamanoi san's secretary. I look forward to working with you. Uh. Right. Kiryu. Good to meet you. Oh. What do you think, Kiryu san? Place looks great, doesn't it? I say they cleaned up really quickly. Yeah, it's incredible. The hideout. Uh, you can now use the office in the Sigita building as your hideout, uh, which ser also serves as your business headquarters. As the story advances, you'll unlock the ability to switch protagonists using the hideout telephone. And there goes my wife. Off to work. <laughs> uh, as the story events, you don't like the ability to switch. Okay, yeah. So we can switch back and forth between Majima and Kiryu. As well as change clothes into any of the outfits you've unlocked. Interesting. Now, how about I walk you through some business basics? Is this a good time? Um, uh, yeah, I guess no, no time like the present. <laughs> uh, we expect the Ghost of Tsushima PC version to come out in late 2023. As of, as of January 23rd, they reported that. I mean, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be unheard of. They, so Sony, or SIE, Sony Interactive Entertainment, I think is what the d department's called that handles all that has kind of taken the approach of, like, the games are exclusive for about two years on PS or PlayStation, and then from there it's fair game. Returnal took about just over two years. Um, Horizon, obviously, that being an older game, a little bit longer. But yeah, it's at least two years, it feels like, for their, their in-house first-party exclusives. Spider-Man 2 is going to take over PlayStation late 2023? Probably, is considering how well the first one was received. Uh. Alright, we're going to learn about business. In that case, I'll let my secretary take it from here. There's a lot to remember, but if you forget anything, you can ask me anytime. For now, I'll walk you through the whole process once. Camarocho Real Estate Royale. In Real Estate Royale, you purchase and manage properties to build up your funds with the ultimate goal of bringing down the five billionaires. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, manage your holdings from Kiryu's office by interacting with the city model on the table. You can also check the status of your properties by selecting business from the pause menu. Uh, you can do the following through the office menu. Start payout collection, collect profits, sign a manager and security, send advisors... Manage your properties using the options we assume be raking in huge profits. Um, let's see. Select Real Estate Royale Management and press Y to uh, display a payout collection confirmation window. You have a signed manager or security guard to the area you want to collect from. Their salaries will also be listed. Select Yes to confirm. So this is very much reminiscent of the same business management that was in uh, Like a Dragon 7. Uh, sometime after the collection is started, the gauge will fill and you'll be able to collect your profits. The funding is gathered based on profit forecasts and economic trends. However, sometimes things will not go so smoothly. Problems may arise uh, during collection process, or you may be challenged to a money battle while collecting your profits. 
The world is a money battle. <laughs> but problem occurs, your collection gauge will freeze. You'll be unable to collect profits until you go find out who's causing the problem and subsequently deal with them. Well, there you go. Sometimes when you collect your profits, one of the five billionaires will challenge you to a money battle. The manager assigned to the area will try to counter the effects of the billionaire's aggressive investment, but if their HP runs out, you will lose the targeted property. Protect your property by pressing A to invest in your own your own money and restore the manager's HP. Because that's how, you know, health works. Uh, you can assign one manager per area. They have the following abilities. Uh, financial savvy. Cuts his HP during money battles. This only recovers when a manager is not in use, so switch them out often. Economic influence. Shows the manager's effect on economic trends in the area. The higher the value, the better. The number on the left is the starting value, and the one on the right is the final one. Uh, after four collections. Signing staff security. In addition to a manager, you can also assign a security guard to an area. Uh, each security employee has the following abilities. Problem solving. Uh, shows the ability to resolve issues during collection. Uh, at high levels, guards are more likely to solve problems on their own. Safety influence. Higher the value, the fewer violent encounters will transfer when walking, when walking in an area. The number on the left is starting value. But number, final value is on the right. Got it. Um, seeing advisors, sending advisors. Send an advisor to visit a property to help make improvements, upgrading its rank in the process. Select a property first, then an advisor, then an advisor. You'll have to pay for their services, but earning the earning potential of a property will improve as, as its rank ri arises. Uh, each advisor has different abilities and areas of expertise, so select the right advisor for each property. Yeah. I think that about covers. Did you follow that? Absolutely not. <laughs> Well, let's get to it. Please give the order to begin collections for our current property holdings. Returnal Day is gone, and this month, Last of Us Part 1 comes to PC, and Marvel Spider-Man Miles Morales also came to PC, so it's not outside the realm of possibility. Yeah. Like I said, it, it feels like it's roughly two years for them to get a port out, and considering that they um, own Blue Point and Nixus, i uh, you know, who have specialized in ports. Definitely not out of the question. Beginning collections. Uh, use the office table to access the Real Estate Royale menu and choose Real Estate Royale Management. Then select Leisure King Area and press Y to begin collections. It sounds like we're just racking up protection money. That's what this really feels like. You can view the rules and controls anytime you need via the help menu. Business management. This is going to be one of those things where it's like, it's going to go over my head until uh, we actually do it. So perhaps now is not the worst time to do so. Oh, man. That smooth business management music. <laughs> We're in the elevator now. With Sony, uh, the only thing out of the question is is Jim Ryan not crying about not someone not being able to compete. And uh, hello again, Saints. Yeah, Jim Ryan seems like an asshat. <laughs> Just from my understandings of like what he's contributed for Sony... They have, they've had a lot of likable guys in that position in the past, but he seems about the least. But yeah, Sony's kind of gotten petty in the whole uh, Microsoft Activision uh, situation. They're just trying to stop the deal. They, they're, they don't really care about Call of Duty. All right, all of our staff's probably trash.
He said his reputation for me when he suddenly started caring about the Activision workplace harassment only because of Microsoft. It's, I mean, I don't think it was his call. I think it was Sony's call. He's not at the top. The very tippy top. Definitely a part of it. But yeah, it's kind of a it's kind of a shitty thing. But at the same time, if you have an avenue to block a deal that is going to hurt you financially, I there's nothing against there's nothing against the law doing that. It's scummy as hell. But that's how it usually goes. Select an advisor. Uh, what is this? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, it's a food place. You know what? Sure, you. I'm invested now. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> These aren't muscles, I just have a big chest. <laughs> Perfect. Stonks. So I'm seeing channel points. Astute observation. Uh, any plans for what we'll use them for? Uh, so what I'm going to do is convert the current things that I have um, in the in the bot that I'm currently using. So things like hydrations and making me do push-ups and, and stuff like that. Uh, from there, uh, we will build. Not totally settled on what I want to make rewards for. Um... We've done we've done things like redeem them for timing other people out in chat. That has you know been fun, but also kind of pissed people off. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that will return in full. But uh, I definitely would like to get some automation going and some fun things. I don't know if I'll go full like video like redeem like kind of like like flooper does i don't know if i'll go that far because it you know i don't like blocking the half of the screen during gameplay but i think there's some fun things that we can do in the meantime uh also channel points definitely for any game where we can do get it done there will definitely be um predictions in use Let's start that collection. That's it. So we're just wait. Time to pay out. Level one. All right. Well, <laughs> you get a collection order like a pro. Now you just need to relax for a bit, and that cash will come flowing in. Oh, and Yamanoi son left me some funds to serve as your initial operating capital. I'll give that to you now. You received 15 million? I'm immediately spending that on a skill point. <laughs> of course, that nest egg uh, and Yurizaki down on the first floor of this building are my little send off to you. Please use them with my blessing. Though relying on a single shop's profit is putting a lot of eggs in one basket. Why not buy another with that cash? All right, you may be. Maybe you're talking me into it. If you want a solid starter, I recommend Sukiyaki Muranaka on Tenkaichi Street. Pretty popular spot, but a still a, but still a comparatively affordable acquisition. Alright, fine. We'll go buy something. 
fine. I won't blow all the money on... Wait, what? Use the funds. Uh, do I need to like go? Oh, I need. Do I need to go out into town and do that? Perhaps. Uh, game vote so I can use the power of. Yeah, I force you into high on life. Um, I don't know, cause like, I thought about that. That's definitely. Uh, I know that's how other people use them. Like, I think it'll be a good idea to use them in order to have people suggest games for me to play. But I do kind of like... Um, I do kind of like having a, an incentive for Discord members. So I'm kind of torn on that in that regard. Rest assured that High on, Li High on Life is still on the list, though. That will be in the next vote since it, I think it was second. Sukiyaki Muranaka. Uh, it's the main outpost of an old school Sukiyaki restaurant. They're always booked salad re reservation. What should I do? We're going to fucking buy it. With this cash briefcase. <laughs> Sukiyaki are not going to receive. You know what happens if there is access to touch tunes? That could be video games instead. True. I want to play. I want to play that game, but I don't own an Xbox or gaming PC. Ah, so you PlayStation then or Switch. Yeah, as for me, I don't own an Xbox, so I, I have a... Obviously, I'm playing on a PC, and I have, a, you know, I have that. I have a PlayStation 5, and I have a Switch. The Switch probably gets the least use out of all my, all my stuff. Second only to PS5, which I haven't played anything on in a bit. All right, we have 10% of the Leisure King area. Yeah, I still have a PS4 as well. No, it's the stairs. Oops. That's what I get for half looking. Oh, welcome back. Looks like you acquired a new property. Also, those collections you ordered are in. Money is ready and waiting for you. A set time after giving the order to begin collections uh, in a given block, you'll be able to pick up those profits. Access the menu from the re office table and choose Real Estate Royale Management. And then select Leisure King Area and press A to pick up the collected profits. Collect total proceeds of one million. Well, why wouldn't we just why wouldn't we just immediately do that again I own all playstations uh, except for the Vita and one yeah I no longer have a PS1 uh, or PS2 I have a PS3. Uh, the main reason why I still have a PS3 is so I can play Metal Gear Solid. Uh, because that is still, sadly, the best place to play the most games in that series. So I've got to keep that working for the foreseeable future, which I actually need to do some maintenance on it. Like, repasting the CPU and GPU. Because... It's quite old now. PS5 is a nice backup plan for when a PC port turns out to be borderline unplayable, which is concerningly common now. It's actually less common now than it used to be, at least from my own personal experience. Like, PC ports were a meme, like, less than 10 years ago, I feel like. 
Um, trying to think of where I was going with that. Oh, right. So, like, there's a reason why, and, and you know, he's not with us anymore, but Total Biscuit... There's a reason why he was, you know, his port reports were like relevant information because it was so, so common. Going back to, I don't even know how long, like when I got back into PC gaming in 2013, so 10 years ago now, um, it was also a mess. But you don't seem to play as many mainstream games. I'm seeing consistent issues on that side. Uh, I play less, less mainstream games now um, than I perhaps used to. I would say I more often than not will play mainstream games, but I often don't stream them because they're saturated in terms of Twitch viewership. Can I not assign anything to... Well, I probably got to keep doing the tutorial. Sorry. One thing at a time. Looks like those profits are... This is exactly when you need to keep watch for one of the five billionaires uh, picking a money battle. Losing that money battle, you lose ownership of a property. So be sure that you always appoint a manager. What are mainstream games? Uh, Some people like to call them AAA games. So like... Games that are published by, you know, like, so for example, to use a Sony example, like God of War Ragnarok, Horizon Forbidden West, like a lot of times they're not always big budget, but they are published by, you know, either first or second party studios. Or Ratchet. Yeah, you would call Ratchet a mainstream game. Um... There's not an exact definition, but that's kind of how I think of them, at least. They're not... It's not completely one-to-one. -one. You know, a game a game can get into the mainstream by being popular. So you could have... You could have indie games that do get popular, and then they become mainstream. But usually, they're the, the games with the largest advertising budget, like your Call of Duties and, and, and things like that. Uh. <laughs> Basically, you want to expand your holdings, grow those properties, and enhance your personnel roster. That will build your share and earn greater profits. The bigger we get by repeating that process, the closer we'll be to shutting down the five billionaires. Uh. Right, I'm on it. Oh, one other thing. I'm leaving it up to you on how to spend any profits in operating capital. In this line of work, you end up spending money in all sorts of ways. Invest wisely. That includes investing in yourself. I don't see how I'm going to spend this much money anytime soon. I can absolutely... I can think of at least two or three skills where we could spend all of our money and be and be broke. <laughs> I don't remember becoming president. Mm. No, but as secretary, it just feels natural to call one making all the business calls the president. Doesn't that feel really secretary-ish to you? Does it? I wouldn't really know. You haven't always sounds the president here, isn't he? Well, yes, officially. What's the harm? If, if Marina san uh, wa wants to call you that, I uh, I say let her. It's actually my first gig as a secretary, so I'm eager to be as secretary-ish as possible. Oh, you're a first-timer at this, too? What did you used to do before yamanoi san hired you? <laughs> That's a big, juicy secret. Hostess. <laughs> Yeah, okay then. Uh, I don't really care what you call me, so knock yourself out. Yay, yeah, let's aim for the top here, Mr. Prez. Right. Seems capable enough. She's a little odd. I see a lot of headaches in my future. Uh, well, uh, I agreed to do this. Going all in.
Phew. I was okay. I was going to meet Oda for that drink. So the place was called uh, Serena on Tenkaichi Street. Go to Serena. Uh, Hogwarts Legacy, for example, massive game with huge sales and, of course, has very bad performance issues. I actually wasn't all that interested in Hogwarts Legacy, so I didn't actually look up um, how the PC port was. That's interesting that it's bad. I know the 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 one of the things I always see, and probably because of how much Digital Foundry I watch on YouTube, is games that have stutter problems. It is unbelievably pervasive. Speaking of which, uh, recent play for me, Shadow Warrior 3. Oh my god, it was so bad with Stutter. <laughs> like, damn near unplayable. But I struggled through. I guess uh, guy next to me sounds like the Monopoly guy. He kind of is. That's, that's exactly what we're trying to do. We're trying to become the Monopoly. Let's go meet Oda for that drink, actually. Did I save? I can't remember. I feel like I did. But it never hurts to do it again. No penalty. It's not like, it's not like Resident Evil that actively punishes you for saving in terms of your rank at the end. いや、俺は待ち合わせで。尋常してんじゃねえよ。錦。よ。なんでお前がここに行きつけの店の一軒や二軒を俺にだってあるさ。この店は今俺の一番の大きい。な、レナ。あら、西木山君の知り合い。あ、もしかして、キリュウさん？あ、ああ、そうだな。うわ、やっと会えた。一度お会いしてみたかったのよ。西木山君、ヨウとあなたの話しかしないから。ね。おい、余計なこと言う
あいつはまだ学生だよでもなんだったらここでバイトさせてやってくれおいユミにこの町でホステスさせんのか人気出ると思わねえかあいつはひまわりの頃から親父にモテるじゃあ期待の新人ねそうかもな,なんだかキリュウさんユミちゃんのお父さんみたいそこはせめて兄貴みたいって言ってやれよ<笑>失言ねそれにしても立花不動産の小田って言ったがちょっと遅いんじゃねえのかどうするもう一杯飲むかいや待つよ先輩をほっといて俺だけ出来上がっちまうわけにもいかないからなふん<笑>なんだよおめえも少しはサラリーマンっぽくなってきたじゃねえかこれくらいで何言ってんだただのマナー常識だろその常識がねえのがおめえだったろうが<笑>言ってろねえそれならカラオケでもどうおいいね歌う歌うバカそれじゃ酒飲んでんのと変わんねえだろうつうかカラオケならこの前もじゃあお前は聞いてるだけでいい俺が勝手に歌うからそれならいいだろう仕事上がりの時くらい硬いこと一個なしよ歌ってる間に小田さんもきっと来るわしょうがねえなよしそうと決まれば全話急げだミュージックスタートAll right, force karaoke again. I gotta be ready because the button prompts are kind of mean. Got a snack, Matt? What'd you go with? Ninety-five. This is the true judgment. <laughs> Everything about these games feels like fever dream. <laughs> It kind of is. <laughs> Karaoke King. Hey, that was pretty good. We we definitely fucked up in the beginning, but we recovered. We recovered nicely. It's. Mostly, and I'm gonna blame it 
on the Xbox control prompts. Because, like, I'm doing the translation in my head because I'm playing on the DualShock 4. So it's like, uh, <laughs> what button do I hit again? I, the same thing happens to me when I'm in, like, when there's uh, quick time events. But yeah, it, it's, a, it's a beautiful fever dream. <laughs> yeah, the whole music video and everything. I wish I could have, like, actually watched it more because I'm, like, constantly, like, worried about the prompts. ニスキヤマクすごい。袋みたいだったわ。だろ<笑> おめえの話を聞くかぎり、そんなルーズなやつとも思えねえけどな。本当ね。事故にでもあったんじゃないかしら。いらっしゃい。<笑> そうだな。ああ、兄貴。なんでここに座ってる。錦山。こちらに身を覚えんだろう。義龍。その説はお世話になりました。義龍様。お前ら、戦友やな。お前らがお田をやったのか。その前にお前がうちの篠木邪魔したんだろう。立花不動産って言え。こそこそ東洋会に立てついてる連中で。組抜けで早々お前も義理ってものが分かってね。親父。ここは俺が。こいつ知ってるか。うちの岡部ってもんだ。例の戦友屋の篠木はこいつの仕切りでな。かわいそうに。おめえのせいでけじめつけちまった。おめえ、今度は何やらかした。下っ端が口を挟むんじゃねえ
正気とは思えねえ。組み抜けたその足で、クレスにしょんべん引っ掛けやがって。おかげでうちは、一千万からのしのぎがパーだ。死に急ぐのは勝手だが、もっと周りに迷惑かけねえようにしねえとな。何か勘違いしてるらしいな。あんたらにわびれる気はねえよ。おとなしく殴られてやる理由もねえ。やる気などな。そうかよ。面白いなお前おれやってみろ<笑><笑>早くやれやその代わりここが最後の一戦だすぐそこに阿波野の親父がわざわざ出張ってきてるそいつを承知でやるってんならその度胸だけは褒めてやるよ。俺の仲間が血流してる。ああ、錦山とそれに立花不動産のお前の連れが<笑>あいつはほんの少し可愛がっただけですぐてめえのいいところ吐いたよ。<笑>てめえ何が最後の一戦だてめえらとっくにそれ超えてんだ行くぜはい、おかべんフレンズ。Basically, trying to turn this into a one on one fight as quickly as possible. Looks like a Majima move.
んで立場の不動産による何わかるい風間の頭に指示されてんだろ俺がわざわざこんな山で出張ってきたがおめえが立場の不動産と絡んでろって聞いたからだ頭の息がかかったおめえがな頭が立場の不動産を使って殻の一つを追ってると踏んでるんだけどなどうだ俺の言ってること間違ってるかどう思うだあんたの勝手だ<笑>もうごまかすの下手だなでも俺おめえのそういうとこ気に入ってんだああ一番の不動産もう殻の一つの持ち主を見つけたのかそうかまだか俺でも手がかりくらいはつかんだはずだ俺は何も言ってねえぞねえいいおめえにいいやなんだなんだおめえは分かりやすくてほんといいぞ泣きよ俺に立場の不動産の社長と合わせろ。やつはうまいこと隠れ回ってるようでな。青にはおめえに仲立ちしてもらうのは手っ取り早い。俺はもう堂島組を抜けてる。あんたに指図される義理はねえ。やってくれりゃ、戦友屋の件は水に流してやる。の一つに手を出そうとしたこともなそれともこのまま的にかけられていいか道島組参加の全組織からだ部署に逃げ込んだとしても無駄だぜ死ぬまで追い込むそれも楽に死ねるこれはおめえだけの話じゃねえ。その次へ、おめえの兄弟も始末。意識や。このままじゃあいつはおめえのとばっちりだ。助けてやれよ。あんた、立花に会ってどうする気だこの一つの情報を洗いざらい、吐き出させるだけだ。その後、部外者にはご退場願う。つまり、殺すってことか。朝まで考える時間があるな。立場の渡すか、おめえが死ぬか。どっちか選んで、今夜中に連絡しろや。狩りを始めるな。今のは当然お前の首で。Well, quite the situation we find ourselves in. And 20 million bonus for a chapter completion? Goddamn.